question number four. So five over three minus two x uh, less than one minus two over three x less than or equals to two minus x. Hence, list the integral values that va that uh, satisfies the inequality. Uh, so you learned about inequalities. We have uh, g uh, less than less than or equals to greater than greater than or equals to. So to be able to get the integral values, we will need to first of all we solve this part here, the inequality that part here. Uh, we get uh, a, a, the value of x in terms of inequality, and then we take uh, the other inequality. That is, we take these two up to there, uh, or rather, I can put it up here. We take this part, those two inequalities, we solve, and then we'll be able to combine x and be able to get the integral value. So we take this one, uh, this we say 5, uh, that is, we say 5 over 3 uh, minus 2x less than 1 minus 2 over 3x. Uh, so we we can put the right terms together that we can take x to the other side or we take it to this other side so we say 2x uh, rather we can say 5 divided by 3 uh, one, when one crosses the, the inequality signs it becomes negative so that is minus 1 when this crosses the, 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 the inequality sign it becomes positive so it is 2x minus 2 over 3 5 over 3, you minus 1, uh, this is 1 and 2 that, so it will be left with 2 over 3, 2 that, less than uh, 2x, here we have x, 2x minus uh, 2 that, 2 that x, this will be 1 and a third x, uh, which we can write in, uh, this is 2 over 3, less than, this is uh, 3 times 1 is 3, plus 1 is 4 over 3x. To eliminate the values, the fraction here, we, we multiply by 3 over 4 and we do the same to the other side, that is 3 over 4. So this will be able to get rid of 4 and 3 and then we have, uh, uh, here we get uh, divide by 2 is 2, so this will give us 6 uh, and uh, before we do that we cancel 3 by 3, so this one we have cancelled. Uh, so we get this is 1 over 2 is less than uh, x. Here we'll be left with x. So we have solved this other part, this part. Uh, the other part is uh, we have uh, 1 minus 2 over 3x less than or equals to uh, 2 minus x. Uh, then we, just like we have done here, put the right terms together. So we take x to the other side. It changes the sign to positive, so we have x minus 2 over 3x. We take uh, 2 that's x to the other side. Uh, no, we take 1 to the other side, it becomes min minus, so less than or equals to 2. Uh, and then we have it will be minus 1. So x minus 2 over, it will, will be left with a third x uh, less than or equals to 1. 2 minus 1 is 1. We multiply both sides by 3 to eliminate uh, a that. So we have this goes with a 3 divided by 3 is 1. So we have x less than or equals to a 3. Uh, so that is uh, the value of x. Now we combine these two and you'll be able to, we can, you write x there. x is less than or equals to 3. Uh, and here x is greater than uh, a half. So since uh, since the x is greater than a half, then it means the next value we get is one. Uh, also, two is part of uh, is part of x, uh, and because x is re is less than e equals to three, that we have an equal sign here. So three x also qualifies to be three. So the integral values here we get it is they are one, two, and three and uh, you'll be able to get uh, three marks so you'll be able to get uh, you'll be able to get a mark for a uh, method mark for this 
a method mark for this and one mark for the answer and that totals to three marks so important thing uh, that is how we solve you run to have to solve inequalities in form two and this is what you are being tested in remember paper one uh, you are tested in the work that you covered in form one and form two so you should be able to remember that